spanning the globe to bring you the constant variety of living, the excitement of work, the thrill of achievement, the moments of your life. Brought to you minute by minute, play by play. Welcome to Play by Play, and thank you for joining us. I'm Nathan Harris. And I'm Terry Wells. And I'm Bill Mancuso. And we are live here in Orange County for a special match as Josh Pantel decides to deliver a presentation to one of his bosses and ask out one of his coworkers, Angela Reese. He's been working on that presentation for a month, and knowing his boss, it's going to be a tough sell. And he has his work cut out for him with his coworker, Angela. Nobody has been able to get a date with her yet. And here he comes now approaching his car, briefcase in hand. We haven't seen that suit before, so it must be new. I think you're right, and it definitely has a look of confidence. And he's going to need every bit of that today. Why isn't this done? My show starts at 4 Uh-oh. It looks like Josh just walked right into a firestorm. Sasha, the host of the Showbiz Talk Show, she's pretty upset about something. It wouldn't be the first time, nor the last. It seems Jason has some footage he was supposed to be cutting for her, but it's not ready yet. I don't know what Josh said, but it seemed to work, and he's got his team back on track. Now it looks like he's going to ask Angela Reese out. Bill, do you think it's the right time? No way. She hasn't given him the right signal yet. Good. Folks, we're going to find out pretty soon whether he gets a yes or a no. Can you take a look at this? It, it needs some quick cuts. And oh, no. He doesn't even go for it. No, he doesn't, Nathan. And I'm not surprised. Let's look at the replay. He made his approach smoothly enough after catching her attention, stopping close enough to have a private conversation with her, and then, of course, had that awkward moment. Well, he's on the move again as another one of his staff stops him. This is a real problem. I mean, if yep, yep, real problem. Okay. See these, this is this okay yeah. here. It looks like his team is depending on Josh for just about everything. Okay. Not working. We need four or five more. Four or five at least, more. at least four or five okay. more. Okay. Here, okay. That's it. Okay. We can, we can do that. Maybe ten minutes. Ten. This minutes? guy's a one-man show. Okay. That's it. Okay. We can do that. Maybe ten minutes. Ten minutes. It looks like Josh has a letter he drafted the night before, and I think there may be a change in the lineup. Oh no! It's Irene and Brett, the two paid interns. It's a shame. They were already at the bottom of the ladder and now they haven't even got that. I'm really sorry, but... They're on a tight ship at that studio. It's the only way they survive. We've got an exciting presentation coming up from Josh as he pitches his new plan for programming to the owner of the station, Melinda Phelps. She's a no-nonsense, hard-nosed woman who's kept the station running even through the tough times. You said it, Terry. Now, let's go back to Josh as he gives us his presentation. And there she is, Melinda Phelps, Josh's boss. Where is he? Uh, he's in Boy, she is one tough cookie. Josh is out of the gate with his pitch, and he's running with the concept. And she's looking at the computer here, and then she's going to communicate with people dating. online. Online dating right now. Is you can see how he uses and direct approach. No wavering, no hesitation. Um, if she shoots him a question, he's got to be ready for it. With attractive people, of course, people like to watch attractive people. And reality. If you look at Melinda's expression, you can't read which way she might be going. She's known for that stone cold poker face. It's down to the wire. Josh's boss could go either way. I know he's got to be sweating it out now. She's on the move. It's all coming down to this moment. Congratulations. And he's done. done it. He put Thanks, everything Dad. he had on the table, and he won. It was a great pitch, and I think one of his best this year. Couldn't have said it better myself. He deserves a few pats on the back for that one. Hold on. I think there may be a new development. Angela yeah. has stopped so Josh in the hallway. I it looks like Josh may have a second chance at bat here. Hey, are you in tomorrow? The question is whether Josh will take advantage of the moment. Will he ask her out or not? I'll see you in the morning then. Okay. Bye. It's not going to happen. I have to wonder what his strategy is at this point. I'm thinking it has to do with mixing business with pleasure. After all, they both have to work together. Well, in the meantime, that was quite the day for Josh Pantel, starting with the meltdown from one of his show's hosts. 
And dropping the ball with Angela. And finishing the day with a pitch to his boss, which he knocked out of the park. And that wraps it up for play by play. Tune in next week as Josh faces off with an efficiency expert sent down to manage the budget at the station. Thank you for watching.